Now lots of people love the look of coral sand in their cichlid aquariums because it gives a very salt water um, look. Um, but one of the disadvantages about having coral sand in salt water, see watch this fish here, see the way it's scratching? I just find that this happens very regularly. Um, normally a fish will only do that if it's got white spot. But if you have um, coral sand in your um, cichlid aquarium, there are the coral sand is very sharp and therefore it can actually damage the gill lining of the cichlids and it does seem to irritate them and so I find quite regularly they will do that itching and, um, and on autopsies of fish that have actually died um, they have actually found ex extensive gill damage on fish that are, that are housed with coral sand so once again the coral sand looks great but it can actually damage the gills of the cichlids because the cichlids are not used to being over such a sharp substrate. They're naturally over um, like basically a very fine sediment which is quite soft. So that's just something to bear in mind. And a lot of people swear by sand because of the belief that it keeps your pH and KH up. Now in general it keeps your pH and KH up if the water goes acidic enough to actually to um, to break down the magnesium bond of the calcium carbonate actually releasing the calcium carbonate so if you're never looking after your aquarium and you don't test your water and you don't really look after them very well the sand is a good idea because it may actually offer a bit of a safety net and stop your fish from dying on the other hand if you are actually looking after your tank and your pH is generally correct the sand will offer you absolutely no benefit whatsoever unless the water becomes acidic enough to actually dissolve the calcium carbonate and so um, it's not a very valid point of view or it's not a very valid argument if you are actually looking after your water parameters so if you are keeping the correct calcium and carbonate level then various buffers that are on the market are going to be far more efficient at ensuring that you're keeping the right KH and um, pH for your aquarium and you shouldn't need to rely on any sorts of coral sand